G'day viewers, this is Troy from Troy's Visual Arts channel. Here's the latest update on my Motorama diorama set. In the last video I was showing you the construction of the uh, circular platforms, the, uh, the actual railings of the uh, posts. Anyway, uh, I've now fitted them in uh, and glued them up and uh, of course spray painted the spray painted the railings and the posts uh, chromium silver so yeah they now are pretty much done and that's how they look so I did a set of big four a fourth set of uh, big ones and a five set of small ones unfortunately with the small ones they are just a little bit too small to to uh, fit a die cast car in there unless it's a small car so what I decided to do instead was to if I'm going to feature these I'm going to stick them upside down I'm going to put a uh, white white adhesive covering over the bottom of the uh, platform and it'll be pretty much an elevated railless platform instead of a railed platform so it'd still be useful like that otherwise there's no use for these but anyway so that's what we're going to do with these uh, smaller platforms it's a bit of a shame though because I mean these came out pretty good but anyway at least I can still use them okay I've also been constructing some other other props for this uh, Motorama Diorama project. So um, yeah, I'll just go grab my reference pictorial reference sheet here of what I was trying to create. I was trying to create something like that, but of course um, I just didn't quite have the materials and. I sort of like design, sort of design these on the fly, and uh, they didn't quite turn out how I want them, but I got it looking good enough. So what, what I'm going to do with these is I'm going to set one car at the bottom, one car elevated. That's pretty much how I'm going to do it. I could make some make some sort of um, roadway leading up to it too if I choose so I made two of two of these spray painted the platforms white and the uh, column silver chromium silver okay now with this uh, star platform I made I decided to glue this uh, middle piece to the star platform by the way um, this star platform is pretty much based off this uh, platform here from from a 1950 Motorama show so as you can see it looks nearly like a star platform so I got my idea from from that platform there to make this star platform I made this a while back uh, with the uh, posts and the railings and I thought I'd make the uh, the uh, circular platforms in the same fashion so so they look consistent and uh, finally I've uh, glued the uh, stage together so we've got the stage and the uh, stage platform all glued together I'm going to Add, add uh, curtains to to cover that uh, gap there so it's pretty much going to be it's going to be pretty much curtained with um, what I'm going to do is fold some glitter paper make it look like um, folded curtains but anyway I base that platform off uh, this platform here Anyway, uh, I might make some more um, more props for this uh, Motorama show. I'm thinking of making something like this. 
make some fancy looking space age elevated platforms anyway um, so yeah the uh, Motorama show I can the Motorama diorama set I meant um, I can pretty much slap this all together and and uh, yeah do some uh, photography with it right now if I wanted to but I feel I should make a few more props before I get started on doing that. Going back to these uh, balconies here. As I, I think I said in the previous video, I need to add some uh, decorative pieces to it, give it a bit more, more, bit more of a fancier look. Add some print it, do some paper prints of, of um, of the car badge logos, and just stick them on there. I wanted to do, I wanted to do some like, some neon uh, lighted um, logos like that, but it's it's a bit of a difficult task, even more difficult than than laying out some neon and some uh, neon uh, tubing. But anyway, I'll I'll work something out and make it look reasonably decent but uh, yeah I most likely would just do some paper printouts and just paper print out the uh, car logos but if I come up with an idea of how I can recreate this sort of fancy uh, lit logo work then yeah I'll do that Anyway, it's coming along pretty good. It's not too far from completion, I don't think. Depends how far I want to go with it. Alright, well, that's about it for this uh, video on on my uh, Motorama Diorama project. Stay tuned for the next update. This is Troy from Troy's Digital Arts Channel, signing out.